Hi, in this video, I'd like to share with you how to download and install OpenJDK 17 on Mac OS. I am Nam Haming from Code Zavaronet. You know, OpenJDK 17 is the blockchain ready and open source Java development kit. JDK 17 is a long term support or LTS release of Java SE 17. It was released on September the 14, 2021, and OpenJDK 17 is uh, distributed as an archive file and trial.gg for macOS uh, without any installers. And this is the official download page of OpenJDK 17, uh, jdk.java.net slash 17. And you need to verify SHA-256 checksum after download and to install OpenJDK 17 on macOS, you need to extract the archive file and then update the Java home and all the path environment variables. So let's head over to the official download page of OpenJDK 17 at this URL, jdk.java.net slash 17. You see, this is the official download page of uh, OpenJDK version 17. And uh, uh, for installing OpenJDK 17 on macOS, uh, you need to download the archive file uh, for uh, macOS uh, x64 bit here, you see. Uh, because I'm using uh, macOS on an uh, iMac computer, as you can see uh, here, you see. So, uh, click on the link for macOS x64 here to download the archive file of OpenJDK uh, version 17.0.1. Uh, okay, the download is complete. Show in folder. Okay, you see this is the uh, archive file for OpenJDK 17. Okay, and now I move this file uh, to another directory, another folder on my Mac computer. So I open a new uh, file window, new file window here, and go to uh, my computer. And I want to uh, install OpenZDK uh, in my user home directory here. Okay. You see, I have uh, JDK 17. This is the uh, Oracle JDK. And now I want to uh, install Open JDK. So just drag and drop the archive file to the destination. Sorry. Okay. Drag and drop to move the archive file from the download folder to my user home directory. And then we need to verify the checksum, uh, SHA-256 checksum of the downloaded file. So um, on the download page, you can see the link SHA-256 next to the uh, link tar.gg uh, here. Click on that link and you can see the SHA-256 checksum of the uh, archive file. Okay, and to know the SHA-256 checksum of the downloaded file, open a new terminal okay this is my terminal and uh, I see the content of my uh, user home directory and you can see the archive file open JDK 17.0.1 here for Mac OS okay and to see the checksum uh, SHA-256 checksum of this file you can use this uh, command Sham that's a for algorithm and then 256 is the number of bits and then the file name is uh, OpenJDK and, uh, and you can see it prints the SHA-256 checksum of the download file here and you need to compare uh, with the one uh, published on the website here okay so the two checksums are identical that means uh, I can safely uh, open and install this archive file. And to extract the archive file, uh, you can do uh, in uh, find a window here. Now right click on the archive file and open with 
uh, archive utility here and it will extract the archive file the archive file okay you see and the folder here is jdk uh, 7.0.1 i need to rename to open jdk 70 okay and delete uh, the downloaded file Set move to charge okay okay and, and in the terminal you can see the directory open jdk and 17.0 by 1 here and we can verify by uh, uh, change the current directory to the extracted directory open jdk you see and change to contents and home and bin and uh, here uh, you can see the java program here and I can type this command java dash version and you see uh, it prints open ZDK version 17.0.1 okay and the next step is to uh, uh, update the java home and path environment variables you see uh, in the terminal, uh, the default shell is the G shell. Uh, as you can see, the default shell is G shell or GSS here. So to uh, permanently uh, set the Java home and path environment variables, uh, you need to create a new text file uh, named as uh, dot 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 G. SSRC or G shell resource file. You see, if I type Java dash version here, uh, the error uh, is uh, the operation couldn't be completed. That means we need to set Java home and update the path environment variables. If I type uh, echo Java home, you can see it prints nothing. If I type echo java sorry path and you can see the path environment variable doesn't include any entry to java home or open zdk directory and let me check the directory again open zdk 17 by by one here okay and then type this command to create a new text file cat greater than and dot g s h r c this is a G shell resource file and then the first line in this file is to export the java home uh, environment variable equal to my home directory and then the folder open jdk dash 7 .1 and contents and home and the second line to export the path environment variable equal java home slash bin and followed by the path environment variable itself okay and press ctrl d to save the file okay you can see the content of the file again gssrc okay now let me try mm, typing java dash version and i need to exit the terminal quit the terminal for the change to take effect and open the terminal again okay now i can type the command java dash version and you see it brings open the k version uh, 7.0.1 if i just type java it uh, brings the syntax of the java command you see okay i can also check the java compiler java c dash version and you see java c version 17.0.1 okay so that you have learned how to download and install open zdk 17 on mac os i hope you found this video helpful 
please subscribe to my channel, like, comment, and share this video. Thanks for watching.